Okay, so I'm back from my one week post-op uh, doctor visit, and he was very pleased with everything. Um, he wants me to use the massage tool on the edema pockets down through here. Um, he was very happy with the, the bruising. Um, I kept asking him about this. Um, because, you know, like I've, I do not know why my mascara does that. Um, anyway, so I kept asking him about this because this was my major area of concern. And, um, he just kept smiling and saying, it's going to tighten up. You have significant swelling. He said, that's what happens when you, um, how did he word it? Something about cause so much trauma inside your skin or whatever, or inside the tissues. And um, then I, I said, so it, it's not fat. And then he just grinned and he he said, if it doesn't tighten up, he said, I will fix it. Um, he's actually kind of a cutie, but um, anyway, and he bragged again on how great I did during the procedure. Um, which made me feel good because as I have mentioned numerous times, I'm kind of a wuss. Um, he also thought that with all this sinus issue and the coughing that I have, it could be, um, contributing a little bit more to the, the tenderness and everything. But he did say I would be tender for, you know, a little, a little bit longer because of all the trauma that was done. Um. But anyway, um, he assured me that everything went well and that um, I look the way I'm supposed to look one week out. Um, he's very confident that this pocket will no longer exist um, in a few months. He said it does take a while before everything tightens up. I still have to sleep in the compression garment for at least a month. Um, I go for my next Morpheus, the 24th, and he actually wanted to see me again, but he said um, I didn't really want to have to take two days off from work. So he pretty much said if the, I can't say the word, and it, and it says, oh, anyway, Allie is her name. Anyway, if Allie thinks I'm still doing well, um, he'll, you know, he, he can just see me on an as needed basis. Um, or once, you know, I complete the Morpheus treatment. So he'll want to see me again. But anyway, so my primary didn't have any openings today. So I used the new fast pace walk-in clinic here in town. And, um, they gave me a steroid shot. She said the, uh, Keflex antibiotic I have been on for a week should have cleared up any infection. So she suspected that it's mainly a lot of sinuses. She said, my ears are both full of fluid. Um, I have a lot of drainage. So she gave me a steroid shot and some kind of prescription cough pearls or something. I've never had those, but I know my, my mother had those before. But anyway, she told me to, to swallow one of those pearls at night and it should help kind of numb my cough reflex or something like that. Anyway, but, um, so everything went well. I'm pleased. The doctor's very pleased. Um, and I'll just kind of check in as I see progress. So once again, if you're thinking about doing this face type procedure, I say go for it. Um, it's expensive. I'm not going to lie about that. Um, it is more costly than I had anticipated, but if it gets rid of my gobbler goozle, as my husband said the day we went in for surgery, he kept, well, as we were walking across the parking lot, he kept saying, hello, we're here for a gobbler reconstruction. And of course, it cracked me up when I was stressed out. But um, anyway, he has a way of doing that. But if it helps out with my gobbler getting gone, it's worth the money and the pain. So 
Thanks for um, checking in with me, and I hope you all have a great New Year's Eve. Stay safe. Don't drink and drive. Um, and have a good one.